The Golden Age of Sharks took place during the Carboniferous period, about 360 to 300 million years ago, when sharks thrived and evolved into many different shapes and sizes. This happened after a major extinction event during the Devonian period. With less competition, sharks had the chance to grow and adapt. It was called the Golden Age of Sharks because sharks evolved into all kinds of forms, with some becoming top predators and others adapting to bottom feeding or scavenging. Sharks from this time had strange and fascinating designs, from long spines and fancy fins to unusual teeth. The Cladosa Lake was a sleek, fast swimmer with two dorsal fins. It didn't have scales and had a more primitive skeleton compared to modern sharks. The Stethacanthus is famous for its odd, anvil-shaped dorsal fin. This feature might have been used for display or to fend off rivals. The Falcatus was a smaller shark with a curved spine on top of its head. This spine may have been used for defense or to attract mates. The Xenocanthus was a freshwater shark with an eel-like body and a long dorsal fin. It had a large spine behind its head for protection. During this time, sharks lived everywhere, from shallow reefs to deep seas and even in rivers and lakes. They played key roles as both hunters and scavengers, showing their ability to adapt to different environments. The end of this golden age occurred about 252 million years ago when the Permian-Triassic extinction wiped out most life on Earth. Sharks, however, survived and continued to evolve, eventually leading to the species we see in today's oceans.